we're going to continue. We're going to restart our under the map game called Snow Under Map Tycoon. Ah, no! Those trees look to be floating, sir. So we have four little starting areas for this. We've got this one. This one is more kind of to build up this mountain here and to build all the way down this way. So this one's kind of more of an expansion one. We don't really want to be building there straight away. Uh, also, none of our lifts are long enough to really go anywhere here unless... I mean, we could build one here and just build like some really small like blue runs down the side. This one's kind of nice, actually. Although this is the kind of coal we want to go to for getting down to this area. However, like steep steep stuff, we could build a, uh, a lift up to here, bring the steep stuff down. Uh, for a green, we could go up there if we get a bit of a bigger lift. So maybe we start here this time. That'll be kind of cool. I think we do that. Um, so obviously we want a good lift up going up to there. Also, there's kind of a lot of space down this area, so we can build like a, all the stuff we need. Because we need like the builders' lodges, we need all that sort of stuff straight away. So let's uh, build that in there. Builders' lodge, boom. That oh, it will fit just about. And let's get four of our guys in here straight away, so it build, they build pretty quickly. Uh, let's just build everything we can really. Now let's go for maybe the snow groomer hanger here because it will bring us around that way a little bit. And mechanics workshop, can you fit in there? Very nice. Okay, this is this is nice. This is good. You want to be kind of economical with your space because there isn't a huge amount of space in this game for everything. So let's get the research lab as well. Um, and it's one singular ski patrol lodge. We will need a lot of those going forward. So let's just get one. Getting in there for now. We'll probably fill this whole Let's area. Up what lifts? They're, they're both rubbish lifts, but be okay. Like, how far can we go? It's okay. It can only go to here. Honestly, though, if we go here to start with, we can do two little runs. We can do one coming down here and one coming down here, and it should be okay. Which one can go further? Yeah, that can go 250, so we definitely want this one instead of the other one. Um, let's go from there to get the run as far as we can. Nice. And that's going to be our little green runs to start with. First, let's build the runs for this before we worry about the other ski lift. Because uh, they'll get building this run. So, hoping we can get a bit of a blue run on this side. If we kind of traverse a little bit, we should be able to come down a bit steeper. There we are. Hmm, I think it's still going to be classed as a green though because of the amount of green. So, if we're going to just be doing two green runs, we don't want much blue. So, let's just get it as green as we can. Coming around. And it's a, it's a little bit curvy, but that's fine. And they'll come straight down to the bottom of that uh, run. Uh, do we want large? Maybe normal on this side so it can fit through that gap, okay? Now, honestly, I think these runs are going to get demolished relatively early. As soon as we can get the six-man chairlift or the, um, no, the four-man chairlift, sorry. So we've got two little green runs coming down there. They should be popular. Um, yeah, let's get the research lab going. Get two people in there and let's start researching for this four-person lift. Probably go with that and the adjustable tension as well as the next few. What's this? That's a ski patrol. Mm, we need volunteers for this. Take someone out of the research lab to put in here. And people should start coming already. Uh, we've got a few uh, red people. So we do need a lift up here very soon. That looks very much like it's going to be a black though because there's not... I found, honestly, with this game that there's not many places that um, it classes as reds. Uh, we tried, didn't we? That's very much too long for this type of lift. Honestly, I wish it would tell you how long it was so you knew how far you could go. But, yeah. It's fine. Now, is this going to be... Okay, we can actually get up to here. That's good. Now, we want to push it to one side as furthest as possible. 
Just so that someone, um, so the lift from this side will fit as well, because most likely the lift from this side, when we do it, will be a gondola. Um, so let's go with that. And hoping we can maybe get a green down here. Although, hmm, not too sure. It might be too steep on these sections, so we might have to traverse it a little bit. Don't really want to block this whole area off, though, because we're going to bring runs down here as well. Let's see what we can do with this run then. One million manpower, yeah, that's a good that's a good one. Ooh, that was blue all the way along here, yeah, cool. Hmm, we just need to angle this right to get it blue. Let's go around the corner. Then blue all the way down. Hmm, kind of looks janky. Hmm, could just bring a run down here straight as well. That might be a red. There's a bit of uh, black run on it, though. Hmm. Let's see whether we can come across this way. Actually, that's a lot better. Now we'll see whether we can get a four-person lift up this way. Gradient's too steep. About up to here? Hmm, come on. Surely not. Like, okay, it'll go there. <laughs> it's not really brilliant, though, is it? That's a much better place for it. Although, we can bring a run down and round. I just don't think it will... I think it will be black rather than red. I kind of thought that we were going to get a red one. Um, let's go with that. Obviously, there's no money, so... It's not really an issue. Uh, right, we're going to go for expanded or optimized this time. 12-seater and 16-seater uh, gon gondolas. Ski lifts increase speed. Ski lifts and streets length. Yeah, we want to go for the length and maximum gradient because it's just a lot easier to put them in. And let's get the 10-person uh, gondola as soon as we get that. Where's the 6-person? I think it's down here somewhere, isn't it? There's a six-person gondola. Uh, we can't get all these. We can get all these purple ones, though. So let's go for that. Oh, and then we want to go for that. And then the mm, the two-person's not great. One-person detachable. Where's the uh, six-person normal one? Uh, yeah, not that. Can we not get the six-person, like, normal? Like, the six-person of this. That's a two-person fixed grip. We don't want that. Hmm. Friction sensors. I think it is a bit later on, but I can't quite remember. These are gondolas. Is that it? Ah, oh, there it is. So we kind of want to come along here as well. Minus two wear and tear is quite good. Gear reducer. Plus 100 miles an hour speed. Yep, cool. 100 mile an hour. Um... We want to come down kind of maybe a normal size. Come down this way. See how red we can get it. This is the majority of the run that we want to be red. Rather than uh, black. So, hmm. Might be a bit janky. But it will really help them like what we're doing here. So, yeah. Hmm. Gonna come around this way, maybe. Okay, that honestly looks okay. This bit's a bit janky, but mm, not too no, not not too bad. And then we probably want to bring like a normal sized a normal run around this way. I'm I'm wondering whether it'll be a black or whether it will be a a red because I want to bring a uh, a black run in as well. So yeah, it's gonna be black. If we go this way, it'll be black, which is kind of good. Awesome. Bring that round, and... Oh, that should have really good homogeneity. I keep wanting to say homogeny. Snow. Yes, lots of snow. How are we doing? Oh, we got a lot of people now. And not many people injured this time. I, I don't know whether they've uh, changed it up or something. Because, like, generally, <laughs> I've found, on average, I have a quarter of my people at least injured at any one time. 
And that's not from being bad, <laughs> I promise. It's uh, probably from... Uh, I don't know. They just seem to get injured so easily. You have to build about a million snow ski patrol ones. So, yeah, it's probably not a good idea to, to build all those ski patrol ones. Um, but, yeah, we've got a swarm of people down here now. How are we looking on the research? We want to get to... Hmm, I'm not bothered about the fixed grip surface toe, like the pommers. Yeah. I'm not bothered about them, but I want to get to... We can get the four-person detachable. Can we not... Oh, we can only get the four-person detachable. That's still good. So, let's go for the gondolas. Have we got a gondola now? Yeah, we've got the ten-person gondola. So... I think we go for... We want to come down here. So, let's do that. Let's maybe come along here so we can get more gradient and all that sort of stuff. Chairlifts, gondola lifts, 50 meter max length, definitely. Um, 13 skiers now waiting for assistance. So, let's let's uh, pump these rookie numbers up. Also, we have an odd number. So, is who's only got one person in? Uh, maintenance... And they've all got two. Maybe services? Yeah, looks like it. So, yeah. These lifts are kind of ridiculous. What is this? What's this? Is this a two-person? Can we fit a gondola here? I hope. Let's just pause it for a second and delete this lift and put the new one in. They're going to be a bit unhappy. But that's not much of a worry. Ten-person gondola up to, like... At Area too steep. Let's get... Destroy that. We're going to have to just rebuild them anyway. It's fine. That's kind of one big issue with this game as well. Is the fact that you have to rebuild everything rather than just editing it. Now, if we push this to the left. I'm hoping we can get a lift from here as well all the way along. Yeah, that's good. There'll be space... Space around them to to build the runs as well, which is really good. Um, uh, let's go for normal. We want to get a blue run again. Come across this way. Honestly, if we want to get green, if, honestly, if we can. So let's try for a green run. I, I don't think we will be able to. Um, we could literally just traverse it all the way around to here. That would be kind of silly when it should be going down to there. Um, I just don't want to block all this. This is good real estate. So I don't want to block it all completely. So maybe we go for up to here and then go for a turn. Hmm, I wonder how it'll look though. That's the problem. I don't want it to look too bad. Let's go here. This is the bit where it gets a bit steeper. So if we can keep it as green as possible. Okay, not back uphill. Hmm. Does just need to be basically flat for it to be a, a green. No, it's probably not the best place to do the turn. Maybe here's a bit better. It still needs to turn to be a green here as well. Let's go for that. I'm I'm hoping that will uh, that will be okay. Let's go for a normal sized one as well here. Um, did you come out of... Yeah, yeah, you did. Hmm. Yeah, it's looking like a green again. If it went from here, what would it be? Like a black? Okay. Hmm. Let's go from this maybe. Hmm, I don't want it to be black. I want it to be red. It can have a little uh, black bits on it. But ideally, we want it to be as red as possible. Because otherwise, they'll hate it. Which, they just... They seem to hate everything anyway, so... I don't I don't, I don't know why I'm worrying too much. Now, this is mainly red. That's pretty good. And that is a very good black run, so... We'll keep on that. Could we get, like, a little narrow one here and through here? That'd be kind of cool. I don't, think, I don't know whether anyone would go on it, but... It's worth a try. Apparently, that's red. Mm. Let's go 
down through here. Extreme run. Um, and you can join the bottom of this black run. Problem is, I, I'm not too sure they really enjoy... Um, like, I don't know whether the AI knows much about joining and, and coming off runs. Because the runs that either go onto another run or come off another run don't really seem to get, um, you know, ridden very much compared to the other ones. We've got a few more volunteers. We've got quite a few people waiting for assistance. So let's get some more uh, ski patrol guys in here. Now... Mm. This is very popular right now, but it's only really because it's the only uh, uh, black and red runs we've got. Like, the only extreme runs we've got. Now, these green runs are really popular as well. But I think we can probably pause and delete this. Delete these runs quickly. And get this 10-person gondola in here all the way up to here. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna eventually have a lift up here, and we can bring a run down to here. So yeah, we want to get that as long as possible, really. Hmm. Actually, that's not brilliant though because they're both gonna have to come around like this. So luckily, there is no money in this game; otherwise, I I would have wasted it all already. But um, we've got plenty of space down here right now. So hmm, do we want to go? Yeah, that's probably a bit better. Yeah, to the furthest to the right as possible, really. And let's make sure they get their green runs back. Otherwise, they're going to be very, very upset. Or, they're all going to get injured and die, which... Honestly, that's fine. <laughs> green run. There, that's a good little run. It's mainly green as well, so they should be quite happy with it. Now, one here. Green. That's nice. Green. Very good. Good, good, good. Uh, we'll bring you to there. Cool. They should be done reasonably quickly. Um, we've only got two skiers waiting for assistance now. That's good. Got a lot of people. They just don't know what's going on right now because everything's being constructed. Um, see if we can fit another builder's lodge in here somewhere. Let's go here for it. How are we doing on the research? Two-person fixed grip surface tow. Um... I'd like to come on to these next, so I'm going to wait for it to be researched. Why is it taking so long? Probably just because it's a bit of a harder research to do. Uh, now, have we got yeah, we've got slope difficulty. Let's stick lines on as well, so we know how many people are in each line. Yeah, this one's getting full quite quickly. I don't really want to uh, make that any better though, because it's it's kind of a small, terrible lift. It's not really for anything. It's just for two runs. Three runs. So, you know, as we as we expand and get more and more runs, it's going to become less and less busy. So it doesn't really need more than what it already has. Now, all the green people have no idea what's going on. All the green and blue people. And I'm glad I'm not seeing any of them in here because... Uh, so one of my one of my run throughs, I uh, I made the mistake of putting the only high altitude uh, food kiosk at the start. Um on top of a, uh, a chairlift like this that only had blacks and reds off and then I literally had like hundreds of people injured because they were all greens going for a uh, bit of food and then skiing down a black run <laughs> so yeah that was kind of funny uh, any ski patrol it's kind of ridiculous um, could get rid of this run honestly probably want to do that Yeah, because we want to build another lift up this way. Let's have a look at the appeal then. Yeah. Oh, the ski patrol ones don't make a difference. It's more this mechanics workshop and stuff. So, I think we pause. Let's get rid of all this stuff here because that's where they're going through, isn't it? We'll do a chain of ski lodges this way. Ski patrol lodge because they're not bothered by that. Um... Yeah, there's still a gap. Uh, yeah, go here. So now they can go through this way and they're not bothered. So if we stick all the stuff in this corner, that will actually help uh, quite a bit. 
with the, everyone's environment. Now, what are you bothered by the environment anywhere else? Okay, they don't like it there. That's fine, honestly. Looks like the gondolas make the environment less uh, palatable than everywhere else. Um, there's a the research lab, wasn't there as well? Which I kind of just destroyed. Uh, too steep. Let's place this in a different resort. Hmm. Problem with it is, though, we don't know which way where we're going to be putting the lifts yet. Probably putting the lifts in this side. One up to there, one up to there. Probably don't need to worry about here. We could stick some blue runs down this way. Hmm. If we go for the lift... Uh, let's just let's just let's just see whether it works. We'll put the four-person chairlift in here, up to here, and we'll build the uh, the runs. Probably just normal runs. Okay, this is a green, green, green. A little bit of blue, never hurt anyone. And you're going there. Now, if we build in here, they're gonna hate the environment. Though that's the only thing. Hmm. Hmm, I don't know. I, I think it's worth it. We'll, we'll try it. If we can get a blue on this side as well, that'd be good. But it might just be green. Looks like it's going to be green. Hmm. If we come through this way, maybe. Background. And there. Very nice. So that's two more greens. Now, we'll probably just build along this way. If they don't like it that way, we can just, at the end of the day, just delete this slope and just have this one. So, let's do that. Um, that doesn't fit perfectly. Hmm. We might want to build a couple of uh, ski patrol things then here. Yep, get in there. Like, just, just so that the people walking along the front there, because they seem to walk along the front a lot, like near, the, just straight from there. They're not too bothered by uh, the state that everything's in. Did I get rid of my builder's lodges as well? No, we still got two. So it was the uh, the, the hangers, wasn't it? Uh, you go to this side. Honestly, going to be fine, I think, if you go this side. We'll stick a couple in next to each other. Then a mechanics workshop. We don't need to fill them yet, so that's fine. You know, it looks bad seeing that amount of people injured, but honestly... From what I've played, I played I played all this morning did on on this map as well, and like it just seems like people get injured well too well too easy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> the the weird thing is as well with this one is like it's all green. <laughs> like it's not like and it, some of these guys are blue skiers as well. Yeah, and they're not like the liability people that just get injured all the time. Nervous newbies. It makes sense that the nervous newbies are like are getting injured on here, like and the walking liabilities. But like every, everyone apparently decides it's probably accumulating. Oh my god! Look at this! Look at this whole run. They're all injured on that run. How are we looking on like the black runs? Like, okay, no one. I know it. There's more. Um, there's more chance of them getting injured and falling if they're the if they're lower ability skiers. Yeah, it's it's, it's kind of crazy. I, I think they need to balance it a little bit because how many uh, ski uh, patrol lodges? We've got twelve ski patrol lodges right now. We're using how many of our volunteers are we using? Well, we're using twenty four out of our thirty eight volunteers. More than half of them to to clean up this this mess and we still have 150 people waiting for assistance so it's probably just a balancing issue it's probably just like a a percentage chance of them falling that they could reduce but they honestly they need to reduce it a lot because this just number just keeps going up it seems throughout your whole game so literally we have a ski resort where nearly a quarter <laughs> of the skiers are injured <laughs> fallen and injured themselves <laughs> in a day because of this extreme green run look how extreme it is it's basically flat if one of these guys turned around and went that way they'd probably start going without even needing to push <laughs> oh my god 
There's just bodies everywhere. It's like a war zone at this ski resort, apparently. Uh, that needs to be built. Um, do we get... Do we get more ski patrol? I mean, I think we have to right now, honestly. Uh, once we get this upgrade uh, down here, it does actually seem to make quite a big difference. Not light vehicles. This one, the first aid training, plus five units per hour work speed. So I don't know how quickly they work in terms of units per hour, in terms of people they sort per hour. Now the slope, waiting for snow groomer. Ah, oh, that could be why. Let's have a look at the slope, slope condition. Ah, okay. Yeah, fair enough. That that makes sense. Like, in terms of the people, like, could we set them as higher priority? Or mm. well, maybe we can set this run as high priority. Set that as high priority for everything. That's why it's it's slope condition is, is terrible here. That's why the snow groomers are not doing a great job because we've not got many. Yeah, we've only got one over here. That's probably why. Uh, we might need to build a few more then. Maybe two more, but... We're going to have to build it where they'll they, they'll be. Because mm. I would like a run to be coming down here at some point. Although, mm. where can we go that's not going to annoy them too much? Yeah, it's, it's just going to have to be on this edge here, isn't it? That's the one other thing. You just don't have any building space. And I wish you could upgrade the buildings. Like, instead of this... You know, only only having two volunteers. Maybe you can upgrade it so that it gets to a point where you can have like ten volunteers in there, and you know, ten snow cats or whatever. Um, we'll go here. This is probably what we want to do. That's probably why everyone's getting injured there. We've set it to high priority now, though. So yeah, now apparently, that's kind of a joke, though, isn't it? Like in real life, like if this run was not pieced. It would not be black. <laughs> it would not be a black standard. It would still be a green. It doesn't matter whether it's pieced or not, really. Unless there was just holes in it. Like, if there's holes to mud, yeah, okay, it might be slightly worse than a green. But it ain't going to be a black. <laughs> okay, the conditions on these ones are okay. This one is automatically bad condition. But it's still got reasonably good condition. It's probably just because no one skis on it. Um... These ones are getting loads of people skiing on them, so that's why. Yeah, definitely. Like it just it's it's not really like um it's not a big issue, is it? It's just a bit of balancing, I think. Like look at this now. We have 350 people who are injured. Most of them on here, I would say. <laughs> it's like a landmine of uh, of people. Um, I'd also like to see the snow, once it's pieced, you can see it. Like, they used to have that on, like, Ski Resort Tycoon 2, which is, like, a game from 2002 or 2003 or something. So, surely they'd be able to add this here. Hmm. Yeah, how quickly are you guys going to build? Because I need you to be built very, very soon. Where are the builder's huts? Are these the builder's huts? Yeah. Yeah. They're moving. Where are you going to? Did I build anything down here? Okay, the, the two of them are building that then, I assume. Um, and the others, yeah, okay, they're building that now. That's good, 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 good. Now, there's a few people injured on this red run. It's saying it is a red because it's got good condition. My days, I can't believe this. 400 people injured. No. <laughs> Oh, they just splattered right in front of us. <laughs> what? How did you get injured? What? We, we, what? It's a kid. Is that why? No, it's a Star Wars lover. Honestly, with that in the background, it sounds like they're sleeping. It sounds like they're snoring. <laughs> oh my god. This is hell. <laughs> oh my god. Oh,